All right, everybody. Another day, another unboxing. For this time, it's a late night unboxing. Uh, this is from Belkin. Yes, another package from Belkin, and yes, there are more lighting cables. I think you can never have too many lighting cables. But this time, uh, let me start with uh, explaining my daily issue here. Whenever I drive or wherever I drive, I use my phone to stream music through stereo and I use my Waze navigation app. And yeah, pe people think it's so funny that I use my navigation app even in my home city. It's not that I don't find where I'm going, it's just that I really like the Waze app. It shows me a lot more than the direction to where I'm headed. It shows me uh, the, the legal speed of the road I'm on, the speed I am driving, uh, which is usually the legal speed or under. Uh, it shows me traffic. That, that's, the really, that's the best uh, function of the way that, that it shows traffic and it redirects me. And it's great. So I, I always have my phone on and usually when I'm in the car, that's where I make most of my phone calls. So yeah, the phone is streaming music, uh, making phone calls via the stereo and using the Waze app. And so of course I have a charger in my car or in my cars. Uh, I always charge my phone whenever I can because I use, it, I use it all the time. I have it all the time in my hand and as I said in my car, I use it all the time so uh, it's very important for me to have uh, a charger in my car it's very important uh, it's even it's so important that I even have one with me all the time so if I for some reason would go uh, and ride with somebody else with a friend or something I have my own phone charger and so but the issue is uh, when I did the, the modified run or many times when I do long trips, I uh, in my 350 ZRS, I usually have the phone connected to uh, to the stereo, so I can use Apple CarPlay. But there, the problem is that um, the stereo via the lighting cable uh, won't charge up my phone. It helps the phone to keep the same battery percent but it won't charge it uh, because I have it uh, going on all the time. And I have an uh, old school navigator also because um, as I said, I usually do a lot of phone calls etc. in my car. So when I go on real road trips, I still want to use the, uh, um, the small old school navigator. Uh, which also needs to get uh, 12 voltage uh, power. And if I have a passenger, the passenger wants to, want to charge your phone. This summer I needed a fan, uh, not that kind of fan, or I don't have any AC in my car, so I needed a fan, which also needed power. And I had a small refrigerator uh, that also needed power. So, as you understand, one, uh, 12 volt uh, outage intake isn't enough and uh, so this package is I'm gonna show you uh, be right back in most of my sport cars I have these very small chargers that are super neat super cool and in my older cars uh, you have the 12 volt outtake in uh, in the ashtray and here I can just close it also in my SL there's no big bulky thing that uh, that's hard to hide this is perfect but this small thing that aren't available anymore uh, are just too weak it doesn't generate the power at all that I need uh, maybe maybe for me uh, myself but if I have a passenger it's it's too weak and uh, I don't really trust it actually 
so it's cool but weak and then uh, in my more comfortable cars these magnets uh, magnet holders for the phone are just just good enough uh, I love them it's easiest to put your phone on and take it away but in my sport cars I can't show you exactly what I mean because I'm using my phone to film this with but the iPhone X, uh, 10s max is heavy it weights over 250 grams so first of all when I put the phone on uh, the weight of it makes the phone angle like this and I hate that I want my phone to stay like this but the phone is too heavy and then in my sport cars as I said the phone uh, vibrates it falls down or in the corner it just flies away so the magnets they're cool if you have a standard comfortable car this is super easy to do but the phone is not safe and I hate it uh, oof, I don't like that so what I got this time from Belkin is I just realized I've been calling it outtake this whole time this whole time uh, of course it's called outlet 12 voltage outlet outtake is so sw swinglish swingerska uh, so that, I'm, I'm, I'm really ashamed about that, but okay, it's, it's 3 o'clock in the middle of the night. So this is what I got from Belkin this time. Of course, lightning cables, as I said, you can't have too many lightning cables. Uh, I would actually like even more, because I would like to have two in every car. Uh, but uh, I'm, gonna, I'm just going to keep on buying these. Here we have those and this is uh, really what I what I needed the most here we have uh, a charger that uh, in the main charger port you have uh, space for two uh, USB cables uh, and then we have this port connected to that that you can uh, use with two more cables so yeah you can charge four phones or four devices whatever with this USB uh, so you have uh, dual and this from that there goes a cable so you can have this in the rear seat and here is also dual so uh, two for the front and two for the rear so yeah this was what I needed the most I think and then we have real phone holders uh, that grips your phone so yeah magnets in all honor super easy to use nice to use but um, I can only use the phone um, diagonal in this way. Uh, sometimes I may be uh, my passenger about to see something on the phone, like a Netflix series or something, and I want to have the phone like this. That doesn't work. But with this one, it does. And uh, you just change it from car to car. You put it in your ventilation uh, outtake outlet. Uh, and then you just uh, open it open and it closes itself super easy neat small little thing uh, I like it that they have I don't know if you can see it uh, this is where you, where you put your cable so the cable isn't loose everywhere so you let the cable run here and just on your phone and I guess you used, to, yeah, you just twist it. Oh, it's nice. It's um, uh, different steps. So, uh, yeah, that's great. 
Let me see what else in the box. Small dick scrap. Yeah, something special. Nothing here, nothing here. All right. So two of those. Uh, great. Would maybe need more. Um, one of this, one of them is uh, absolutely going to my three fifty three fifty set RS. Uh, one of them in my Rocket Bunny eighty six. And I would like to have one in my Corvette also, but we'll see about that. Cables are used like before, uh, the nylon threaded cables. I did uh, a post or maybe a couple of posts where I compared cables. And um, I really do think that Belkin gives you the most bang for the buck. They, they can take a lot of damage and uh, they usually doesn't give up that easy and if they give up for some reason uh, the older cables that didn't have uh, this um, reinforcement here so the older cable as every other Apple cable they got weak here and uh, Belkin has I won't say lifetime warranty, but they have pretty long warranty. Uh, so you just, if you're having a problem, send them a picture of your cable uh, where you have cut it in two and uh, they will send you a new one. I like this, uh, I have black, the other cables that I have are black, uh, but this is kind of cool, like silver platinum metallic something so yeah that's cool you put the cable like this in your phone or if you really want to secure it you have it like this and then in your phone or whatever so yeah that's nice and then we have the main thing that I needed. This is a must for, uh, of course in my Lexus I have uh, outlets uh, everywhere. There are outlets for the passengers, there are outlets in the middle in the doors and in the middle in the front by the legs so that's um, that's just amazing but every other uh, normal car usually don't have any kind of uh, outlet in the rear seat so here is your solution this one in the front for you and your front passenger and then you have this almost two meter long cable is it really two meter 1.8 meter six feet cable and you have this for your passengers uh, in the in the rear seat so this is excellent this are really needed so yeah that was my late night unboxing that took <laughs> way longer than it looks like so please give me a thumbs up please subscribe please hit that bell button and I really need uh, to get more subscribers I really want to hit that thousand subscribers so I can uh, get my hands on uh, the editing tools that YouTube only have for uh, for those who have more than thousand uh, subscribers so yeah please help me with that and uh, yeah check out Belkin they have everything for your, for your phone uh, they have the best uh, shield cases uh, screen cases no screen shields yeah screen shields there's probably have cases also uh, I'm just waiting for the stores in Malmö to get that I'm gonna get that as soon as possible for my XS Max and they also have 
cases, uh, shields uh, for the Apple Watches. So yeah, check out their website. And thanks, thanks for watching.